Each week we take you inside Cal High Sports with athletes who are outstanding for a variety of reasons. This week our Marissa Lovis reunites us with a high school star from the past, now kicking it in the major leagues. Tree Stephen Betisher is making his mark in the MLS this season with the San Jose Earthquakes, but it was his days in blue and gold at Leland High School that made Stephen the player he is today. Inside Cal High Sports. This week's All-Star is Leland High's Steve Bittisher. Here's Bittisher in the second half racing past the defender. His name is Steven Bittisher. You've seen him on our show before. It was back in 2005 at Leland High School when Steven started making a name for himself on Cal High Sports Bay Area. I am Steven Bittisher from Leland High School. But his love of the game developed as soon as he could understand how to kick a ball. I just grew up when I was four or five years old playing and just playing every day, you know, in our backyard we had little 3v3 goals and then behind them we had big goals, so we just always invited all the friends over and we'd play little 3v3 tournaments in the backyard, so just, I love playing it and just nothing more I'd rather do than play soccer. Steven's stellar playing abilities at Leland earned him a scholarship to San Diego State University. His college career was so successful, in 2010 his dream of playing at the next level came true. Steven was drafted in the second round to play in the major leagues by the San Jose Earthquakes. It's a dream come true, uh, being in the stands when I was younger and rooting the Earthquakes on, now being on the field and playing for them, it's just a dream come true. Being able to stay local and return home to the Earthquakes is not only a dream come true for Steven, but also his family and friends. Steven knows there will always be someone there to cheer him on. He's got a lot of friends, a lot of family, cousins, you name it. So they're all just, you know, either texting me or sending me messages or calling me saying, you know, keep up the good work. Just we're proud of you. So. Always have a fan or two at the game. Uh, a little more than that, but yeah. <laughs> Steven's style of play has evolved over the years. In high school, Steven was the ultimate playmaker. But once he entered college and the major leagues, he was forced to expand his game and learn how to become a defender. In high school, I was more of a playmaker, center, mid. I didn't really defend. Uh, going into college, I really learned how to defend. And then obviously now in the pros, you know, being right back. So. Uh, developed in that sense and also tactically where what to do when I don't have the ball at my feet. So far this season the earthquakes are off to a tremendous start. Steven feels that anything less than making it to the major league soccer finals would be selling the team short. We've got so many great acquisitions in the offseason. I said it since preseason. I said our team is good. If we don't get to the finals I think it's a letdown. So we have a good team and I expect a lot out of us. Steven not only has his mindset on the MLS finals, but hopes to continue his domination and one day be a part of the U.S. national team and compete for the World Cup. Hopefully U.S. national team, that's one goal. Um, playing the World Cup, that's I think the ultimate goal. But yeah, just got to keep working every day, get better. Despite Steven's busy schedule of practices, traveling, and games, he always has time to return to his local high school and cheer on the Chargers. If they're playing a big rival team or in CCS I'll definitely go watch and root them on. It's Steven's dedication and love of the game which make him a major league star. Steven and the Quakes are off to a great start this season with Steven's great play in the back a big reason why. Yeah they have an outstanding team this year they expect big things and also it was fun to see Steven back in his high school days at Leland. I shot that one game he had three goals in the game and uh, he's been forever grateful for, for me being at that game because he did so well. A very nice guy. <laughs> yeah, really, really, really nice.